Welcome back to Offworld Trading Company. Presumably the last mission against Beta Research Corporation. So let's start it. Ooh, we have a ton of resources, it says. So there we go. We can get that iron. With Alpha 3 team reporting in. There we are. We, we have, have the water, we have some food, some electricity, which is normal. Oh, and a medium height, okay. We want some steel production. We want some aluminium. Aluminium, there we go. Two, do we have some as three? Three. Three. There we go. Some aluminium, uh, silicon, high level found somewhere. There we go. Should be our last claim. It seems he's going there too. Oh no. Is he? Is he though? Are we faster? No. No. A geothermal vent. That will be useful. I got it. I got it. Under construction. Yeah, I got it. Ooh. Now we can get uh, GSM events if we sell shoes. Um, they have high power and upgrade, naturally. And they work in the night. So, uh, let's get some additional food. We get some oxygen and some. Oh, what now? Don't need nanotech. We get this water. Is this four? It is three. Okay. We get this water to be safe. There we go. Now we need one glass furnace. And I want the geothermal generator. I don't really need it right now, the generator. Because I have enough uh, power in my v uh, power vault for the night to hold on to. What is the steel mill? Let's build around here our glass. So we go. The now we should. Is Wait. Uh, did we get another claim? Uh, or yes, we got another claim. Okay. Now we have so much iron again that we can get more steel. And you see, we have a hundred energy left from the night, so no problem there. We need to get again ten. Let's see shares. Yeah, ten shares. So we are waiting to get an upgrade now. As soon as we upgrade, you see we need we need another electrolysis reactor to get some of that oxygen and fuel. There we go, we are now at zero. How much until we can upgrade? We are getting there. We can get some water gone, there we go. Now we can get to this. There we go. A little bit more fuel and oxygen, hopefully enough to get this up and running. We still have a little bit iron left, but we can get more and produce more steel. The whole game, the whole campaign, I am more focused on getting steel and glass up and running and sell that for profit. If possible. Let's see if we can get another silicon. We could. Um, yeah. Do we want? Do we want more glass? Yeah. With uh, with more glass, we can upgrade faster. And faster upgrade is what we want. Building which need carbon collected from the atmosphere. Whoever wants that. I am not interested, to say so. the least. There we go, a little bit glass. 
And now we are producing a lot of glass and steel. And we can upgrade. We have increased our there we go. Rates by a lot. Now sure I do want some, uh, at least one geothermal generator, which should combat our night production or uses, usage of the power. Let's see, how much power do we have after the night comes to an end? Let's see, we are under a hundred. Okay. It's not really going up. What we can definitely do is get another one of those. Yeah, we are definitely cutting it short. So, here's the thing, I, yeah. I want, I want energy in the night. I don't want more energy per se. I want them, I want the energy in the night. Now we can now produce Scientific more glass. Expanded. There we go. Because we have silicon. We have so much iron. So we definitely can produce more steel. And let's see. If that finishes, we have one claim left. Do we maybe want another another geothermal? Yeah, let's go with that. So we get 2.8 in the night, which should go against uh, our uses. And the solar panel should be able to get the power in the day, as soon as they go um, are up and running. Later on I can say look at constructing a solar panel, additional one. But at the at this time we should be content with this. And I can upgrade in a little while as soon as my uh, aluminium is going in. I don't want to buy it because the aluminium is on an all new high. Here we go. And then I can get another steel mill, even two. I can get some more power, some more... Hmm... I don't really have that much to Free bar a bit. I definitely don't want you to get pirates. Six, you will try to get them eight, until thousand, I nine, get thousand, to 10k. Ten, Ah, uh, you don't 12, want to thousand, let loose, do you? 14, Come on, mine. There we go, pirates. And now we can see... Oh, big stuff. There we go. Pirates. I this should be glass, yeah. Bandits. Should me be my glass now. There we go, in the night we only lose 1.4 now. Which is pretty good. Now, ba -ba -ba. I could sell this for like, um, uh, what now? Um, do I go on the offensive? I have the feeling yes. Let's go and buy some stocks. Get uh, rid of those. Scientific colony expanded. Uh, it's getting a little bit more expensive, but we have 120k and we won. It goes, the FPS goes down really quick as soon as we start buying stocks, but as you see, we got him. We finished. Sadly, I can't really check his graphs, but okay. And... We elim eliminated him, and we don't have any more missions. We don't get any more income. We now have one dynamite per game. Yeah, I, I don't have a mission. You must select a mission. Um, I don't know. I am. Um, I I am done. There doesn't seem to be some. Uh, some winning screen or something like that. I simply won. So the game, uh, as you saw, it gets a, 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 
<laughs> it gets easier if you get the right the right perks. I think perks like Epsilon Espionage hat would not win me the game. One EMP, one underground nuke, meh. Beta Research had all the stuff coming in as soon as they upgraded. Alpha Patent had some other free stuff. So if you get the right, the right uh, perks, you can easily win. You can even unlock different HQs, depending on how the game map plays out. So pretty, the game is really nice. Let's see. We can now exit because we can't do anything. Maybe something comes in later on. Let's, uh, yeah, there is not really, we could, you can go quick play. And then, uh, see what here, is, what is here. Yeah. Still a really good game, but I don't think there is much more to see. We saw the enemy AI playing. And we can't do anything here in the campaign. So yeah. I think this will be the end of this particular series. Maybe later on, if it, uh, the moment it releases full as a full game. Or maybe they update uh, some major or got some major updates. Maybe then I will come back and look around a little bit. But as it stands now, pretty good game, pretty interesting, something dif uh, different than what we have on the market right now, which is why early access and indie games are so prevalent to the state or on the state, because they can experiment with stuff that AAA are not daring to experiment with. So yeah. Don't forget to subscribe, share, like, and comment, and as always, thank you for watching, and I will see you next time.